Here they are. We, we are on film, gentlemen, so here's to uh, the, the human revolution. I hate to get all violent and stuff, so yeah. we're going to save the world this way instead. All right. Beth, Ann Kirkpatrick, Tom Chabin, Bill Mundell on each clipboard. So that's a total of six. In addition to, uh, uh, some. nowhere, huh? Like after me, well. So, Gerald, while we're on video, let's go ahead and do this. Yes. Um, I was telling Joe, he, Joe asked me, so do we have walk lists? And I said, yes, we do. I have, you remember from 14, I divided this neighborhood into different walk lists. I have them there on that little tablet, which you can access and we can just like do it however we want. Okay. Boom. Last time that I came to town, you had done something different. Will you tell Joe about that? Because I thought it was pretty successful. And then Joe, as our field director, you need to decide how you want to do it. Is uh, also the uh, public library open on? Yep. Sunday here? Wait. I cannot confirm or deny that. I can confirm that in Kingman it's closed on Sunday. So it's, it's Phoenix closed is, here. Phoenix is closed. Most closed of here. Two on Sunday now. So there's um, people who need libraries. I go. I would go into the American Legion over there and get cussed out, but I'll do it. That, I wouldn't <laughs> want you to do that. That would be the wrong thing to do. Please don't do that. So, but we. But uh, when we went to Walmart, I thought the American Legion were full of guys who fought for freedom. Yes, they're full of people who hate Hillary Clinton and and, uh, and, you know, and this guy right here. But so they <laughs> so they really didn't fight for freedom. No, 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 no not really for what's called no, no, freedom. No. So they, they fought for the right to sing those songs. That's me, and you already signed for keep leading. Uh, Joe, I'll, I'll keep leading a little bit. Yeah. Um, so last time, Gerald and I were able to keep pretty darn busy at Walmart, two people there. I'm supposing that uh, there's some other places that we could go that are fairly close, both to Walmart actually. You had gone to Big Lots in that parking lot, which was successful. Riverside Park is right there. I mean, Rotary Park. Rotary Park is the shit in Bullhead City. There's all those people going down to the beach. It, and it's warm enough to where there's the water sports going on. We could send like four people down, four people down there and, and work that. Give them out cards. <laughs> Gerald, what we've done here is I've, I've set up the clipboards. We need to get them in the right order, but the clipboards are set up for all the candidates so they get a chance to get the signatures. They're in a hierarchy, so I mean, I'm on top. Yeehaw. And, um, what I'm talking about, there's you, there's me, Beth, and Kirkpatrick, Tom Chabin and Bill Mundell. You have to, you can't sign his. Harry? Yeah. There you go. And that's the, the back of the stack, right? So it, this bull hits so who's, who's, who's down there? Uh, districts or is it just open? Oh. Yeah. Okay, so you can do them. And then that last the district page maybe is uh, Gerald and he's here bull hits. You can't sign his. Well, yeah. we have, um, uh, pull one four of those slash out five of oh, the six yeah, pull that one. city council positions over there. Yeah. There's supposedly only 29,000 people in Bullet. Right. So, what's up? Am I being okay? Cutting it yeah, up into yeah. the district. Yeah. I think you're Don't just going to understand that. Is it four or is it five? five? Tom, I grew up in 6,000 in 1980. It's 6,000. Phone on me. Good friendship. Right, absolutely. Six city council districts. Being able to be someone's motivator. Right. And it's always has. Okay. So, um, hi, I'm so-and-so. I'm volunteering with the Michael Weiser for Congress campaign. We're working here in Bullhead City today to try to get some of these guys on the ballot. Are you registered to vote? That's Everybody that. who runs needs to have signatures to be on the ballot. Are you willing to are you interested in seeing the election have more than one candidate? Right. So, for each seat? who do you have on the clipboard, my friend? Oh, I've got Michael Weiser. He's running for Congress. He was the Democratic nominee last cycle. He's a former school teacher here in Bullhead City. He's working on education. I've got uh, Ann Kirkpatrick. 
She's a former congresswoman here in Arizona. She's challenging John McCain. I got Beth Weiser on the clipboard. She's in her fourth run here in Mojave County to fight the Republican Party. She's running for left representative in LD5. I also have She's two. She's on her fourth run because she wants to have people representation down in the Kingdom of Maricopa rather than representation of the lobbyists. Exactly. That's my girl. Then we have two guys that are running for Corporation Commission. Corporation Commission is Tom Chavin, who's a former state senator. Republican state senator. No, Tom Chavin was a Democrat. Oh, okay. And Bill Mondell, who's a former Republican, who is also in the Corporation Commission and in the Justice Court, So he and a state representative. So he actually served in all four branches of Arizona government. Mondell. Mondell did. So he's pretty qualified as far as we're concerned. And then last, my second, well, third favorite, love you, bro. Behind my wife and myself, this guy right here, Gerald Ross. Dun, da, da, da. And you have to live in Bullhead City to sign for Gerald's page. If you live anywhere in this part of Arizona, you can sign all these other guys. We want Gerald to finish off his list. He needed 350. You're already at like 380 or something. No, so he's not at 35 sheets. 350 sheets. He's at 350. But if you need 350, you need about 500. So this is the cushion for the pushing for our buddy Gerald. Yeah. We want to like go over the top for him. And um, the statewides, Kirkpatrick, Chavin, Mondell, they all have a challenge that they have to have signatures in each county. So this is helping them get their signatures so they'll qualify. So this is part of why I'm saying that, you know, I was on the phone with Bill Rowe, the Vice Chair today, you've got to work for our campaign, Bill, because we're doing your work. Yep. This is the Democrat work right here. Democratic. Democratic work. This is the work for Democrats. Because yeah. the mission statement of being a Democrat is to work to elect Democrats. That's what we're going to do to here today. She said, uh, we're stuff right there. Disappear off her that little dot? Mm -hmm. That's what so she had her Dude, down. Gerald, you're waving hi. We're looking at you on the uh, on the walk list. Oh yeah, yeah. So Gerald's right there, and that's this neighborhood where we are. Okay. I'm this other one goes like this, kind of overlaps right in there, and it's over in that area. We have two walk lists. We have at least two teams, and I think that we can start the uh, right launch.